Mm. Hello everyone, uh, you know that I'm a fan of Ukrainian food and I want to show that Ukrainian food is one of the best in the world and today I want to cook uh, the uh, just a simple, simple um, uh, pork ribs but I will cook it not in a beer, I will cook it in a kvass and if you want to find how to cook the real Ukrainian kvass go see this video, you can put a, a like or you can put bell uh, and you can uh, uh, put some comment because I want to see uh, do you like Ukrainian recipes, do you like Ukrainian food, am I doing everything right? So help me uh, to make good content and I will help you to eat nice and good food. The most interesting thing in this recipe is that you combine four tastes. Uh, first one is uh, pork ribs, then kvass, uh, some oregano and uh, garlic. These four simple tastes will combine together and will blow your mind. Just Trust me. What I'm doing first? First, I will cut uh, ribs in uh, small pieces because uh, I'm a fan of uh, I'm fan to eat uh, uh, pork ribs not uh, in a rack, but I'm fan to eat them uh, separate. So uh, it's uh, first what I'm doing. Next, I uh, I turn on my pan. I don't want to cook uh, ribs uh, uh, on a grill because if you cook on grill you will uh, feel this uh, uh, nice uh, uh, smoke aroma but if you pre-cook ribs just in a normal pan uh, you will not have this uh, uh, smoked aroma and uh, actually the secret of this dish is not uh, to have uh, the smoked aroma. I put here some olive oil, not much, like this and ribs in. Just a few minutes from each side and that's all. garlic just like this in few more minutes and that's all we see this a uh, nice brown color that means that our ribs are gonna be great now I take baking uh, tray and put here ribs garlic and uh, oil is combined together and has a very nice aroma so I need uh, here a lot of oregano because the combination of uh, pork and oregano is something uh, uh, quite nice and it's uh, quite uh, popular in Ukraine and kvass. Yeah. Near two glasses of kvass I add here, I put here, salt. Now I take this tray, put it in oven for half an hour, the uh, temperature 180 degrees Celsius. I just can see that the uh, uh, meat is like prepared super well. If you will see that the uh, bone is easily can separate be, uh, from the meat and uh, this means that meat is very soft and tender. Only half an hour and you can feel that this ribs is completely different from that we should try it before. You have here some uh, liquid and if you want to make from this liquid some uh, very nice sauce, what I advise you to do? I advise you to take some butter and combine it with uh, flour, like this. And put here. Then some whisk. But be careful because it's extremely hot. Do like this and you will have bread sauce. The liquid evaporated and the taste of bread is still here. So, one big spoon of bread sauce here. Nice, soft and very intensive taste of uh, ribs and the bread. It's very famous Ukrainian dish, which called Vareshaka. Mmm.